Today we've been working in this school that has now been converted to a shelter hosting 163 people. There are children, there are adults. We had a children's activity where they were working on arts projects and at the same time creating a safe space for them to share their ideas, um, to share their fears, talk comfortably and safely about the things that they want to do, their dreams. It's also a way for them to express themselves uh, in such a very difficult situation in the country. We aim to continue support to this centre and other similar centres that are providing mental health and psychosocial support services. Mental health and psychosocial support is a key part of any humanitarian response. It has to be there from the beginning. It cannot be an accessory, a luxury or an afterthought. We are here supporting Ukraine during this crisis time by providing um, a surge capacity to the mental health and psychosocial support professionals in the country. We recognize that there are lots of capacities within Ukraine in terms of psychologists, psychiatrists, social workers, educators. So we're trying to provide more support to address the increased needs and the huge gap in mental health and psychosocial support services in the country.